air feel so heavy in here? After months of secrets, subterfuge, and indoctrination, they brought me into their fold. This place is elaborate, to say the least. Despite the modernistic visage, the research they have been doing here seems to date back to over a century ago. This place has history, and from what I can grasp, this facility is only one branch of many. Institutions, powerful families, their reach seems grand, and therefore the possibilities for me seem equally as rich. Clearly, my own unique methods at Beacon have piqued their interest, and I am most grateful for the opportunity. Most of what the researchers have been working on, however, seems archaic by today's standards. They told me budget is of no concern. Results are the only thing that matter. Juggling duties here and at the hospital seems manageable, but Reuben, comparatively insignificant, but even at his young age, his studies are remarkable. Perhaps one day he will even assist me with my work here. This is not a negotiation, Dr. Jimenez. We are expected to reach a solution, hence the founding of this facility. I understand that, and I, I appreciate the time you've given me. Time has a limit, and we're approaching that point. If you've outspent your usefulness, we will need to find someone more suitable. Let's not be so hasty. I've done tests with our visual diagnosis, and there is something I must speak to you about. Please, come with me. The projector is in the next room. It's my hypothesis that we haven't succeeded because so far we've only been using visuals, audio stimuli, passive influence, even on my patients with limited mental capacity. This method is rejected by the user. If we are to accomplish what we intend, we will need to refocus. We need direct access. And what do you propose? It's, how shall I say, a pet project of sorts, a mechochemical process. With it, we should be able to have a direct influence on the individual, potentially even access their subconscious. I have the data in the next room. Let me show you. That video. I remember they showed me that when I was brought here. <laughs> 